A local McDonald's employee seen on camera attacking a customer. Did you not a witness who was there at the time says the employee isn't the only one to blame. I was just astounded. I, I've, I've never seen anything like that. You know, I think the, the customer actually instigated the thing. That man asked us not to use his name, but he is talking to News 4 Jacks and describing how the fight escalated. And we've also learned McDonald's is investigating the incident and that video has now gone viral. The trouble was at the restaurant on St. John's Bluff Road and Beach Boulevard. News 4 Jacks reporter Scott Johnson is there and is joining us live with what else the witness had to say. Scott. Well, Mary, he is blaming both parties, the employee, the customer. Started here at this McDonald's, St. John's Bluff Beach Boulevard. You see in the video, the employee who he thinks was a manager walk around the counter and just start slapping this customer. The video starts with a McDonald's employee seen walking around the counter, at first yelling, then slapping the customer across the face. What's up? I was there when it happened yesterday. You were there when it happened? Man who asked we don't use his name was there. You see him right here at the center. He says the video doesn't tell the whole story, telling me the employee appeared to be a manager and was being verbally abusive to her employees. He says the customer complained about her behavior. The two argued, and the witness says it escalated from there. The customer took her whole cup of Coke and threw it at the manager, which is soaked her. The manager came out from behind the counter, confronted the lady, kind of butted her up against the uh, the counter and slapped her in the face and knocked her glasses off, knocked her cell phone out. And there was coke, drinks all over. McDonald's released a statement from the franchise owner. I do not condone the behavior depicted in this video. We are currently investigating this matter. We don't know whether the customer was hurt. In the video, she appears to return to the counter and complete her order. And as far as charges here, well, I talked to a criminal defense lawyer who says the employee could be charged for battery, and it's possible the customer could be charged as well if she did, in fact, throw a drink. So far, we have not heard anything from police on whether any sort of report was filed. Live on the South Side, Scott Johnson, Channel 4, The Local Station. Well, Scott, this is startling. Was the employee who we believe is a manager, was she back on the job today? It does not appear that way. I did stop and talk to a few employees who say we can't comment on this at all, but they did tell me that she's not working at least today, if not in the future. Back to you. All right, Scott Johnson reporting to us from the south side.